50 million naira, $50,000. You can talk to any lawyer. You can hire anyone. And I'm talking about the real ones who knows why they are going to be paid. And that's why we are going to get involved as diasporans. If you don't believe in the cause, please don't join. Don't, don't, don't join it. No, there will be GoFundMe. There will be Bitcoin link. That's where I am complete. I'm a complete novice. So that's why I said, if you have an idea how to set up that uh, blockchain, Bitcoin, and the rest of that, that one is even safer and faster to reach our targets than go for, go fund me or any other ones I personally know because I don't feel comfortable sending money to an account. But I have one which is not in my name. It is Diaspora Radio International official account. So I'm going to make that available as well. I don't take any money there. I know they do adverts. We be say people, they pay me. You see everyone that gives me money, yeah? Or oh, Mayegun is very political. They give me money through PayPal. Mayegun, well done. Take this. I know it's not my money. And I don't give account to anybody on that. Now me get on. When people go onto my donor box or they go onto my... Uh, everywhere that I have link where people can donate and support me and support my pl uh, platform. That comes to me. I don't give account to anybody. That's my money. But you see, Diaspora Radio International is really meant to be the official account of uh, Diaspora Radio International UK, which simply means every penny that goes into it, right? The UK financial uh, what do you call it? the financial sector in the UK or the financial authority in the UK, they will always be interested in it. So I prefer that if I have to give you any. For those our, our people who find it difficult to, uh, you know, to, 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 to use a PayPal, to use a cash app, to use, a, what do you call it, GoFundMe, to use all this online uh, Whatever. Some, some people don't even feel comfortable using their credit card or using their debit card online donating they feel like well what if they steal my details so there are means that we can always get to that uh, details but again again don't quote me on anything yet this is me playing with different ideas in my head when i need help to set something up i will reach out to you now you have my message and if you want to say my don't worry we will, we will help you with this side we'll help you with that one in fact this is how we can do this and that as long as my role as uh, the administrator over this. I know they share role. I know they do conspiracy. I know they do private talk. I am a terrible person. I don't do private talk. I'm not somebody you can be on the phone with and say we are discussing about Igbo fund. I don't do it. I'm not somebody that you can say, I'm texting my ego. We have been discussing ideas of how we are going to do the fund. I don't do it. So don't feel offended. If you feel like I'm, you are trying to call me, to share idea with me, I won't pick your calls. If I need you, if I need your help, yeah, I will ask and I will call you. Apart from that, everyone participating in whatever I'm going to set up, you can find out who is giving what, when, how much, where, you know, all those stuff. You will see all of them online. I don't even need to give you updates. Just refresh the link, refresh the page. How much the money now? Ah, $25,000. Wow. Hey, who gave the $25,000? You will see their names there. You will see their messages there. I am donating this money to support the legal aid for Uluya. You know what I mean? That's how I do my thing. I don't do private talk. I don't do one. Or, I don't share ideas that way because I don't fancy scandals. I don't fancy one sock me, one sock me. I'm somebody who will be saying, I want my mopo. If you want to fight me, fight me. No talk say now the person where we were talking to told us he told us because he said it and no, I don't do that. Just face me. And that's how I'm comfortable doing things. And I can tell you, my friends, they trust me that much. So we need that. And I hope I I really don't want to say much on what and what are other things we are other things we are going to do. But the primary purpose of this is that number one. We in the diaspora, we are no longer going to sit back, complain, rant, lament, I mean lament, and continue to organize protest here and there, at the same time waiting for the effort, other effort to match up, but they are not really forthcoming. We want to take it next. Trust me, 
this liquid or, or so, eh? Some people have told me, they said, why haven't we managed to get the Yorubas in Benin Republic involved? Why are there no serious protests in Benin Republic? Some even said, why are we not loading the Yorubas to Benin Republic, to occupy Benin Republic for a whole week, when you can send, like, let's say, 5,000 people, and you pay them? I said, all of them get too many ideas, okay? But not be all of them will go share. But you see what we're about to start, eh? It will help us in a great way. But the first thing is that uh, we have it uh, every of our move, eh? being legally, legally guided, legally protected and the rest of that so that we will stop we will stop uh, hoping on people who possibly are doing nothing tangible but making money from this I remember when they said this uh, Benin Republic lawyer told the people to stop uh, protesting or something like that yeah I remember that some said that uh, the lawyers told them not to protest. Some said that uh, the lawyers said that uh, they should continue the protest. Maybe that one will help. But you know when they were making all these contradictory, contradictory uh, statements, yeah? In the background, there's absolutely nothing going on. <laughs> you know what I mean? Absolutely nothing. Oloye. In his uh, in his uh, lively way, it was like, you see these people that will tell you, are you going all these people that will tell you that uh, they have contact with Obasanjo, they have contact with uh, Attorney General of Benin Republic. They just they just dropped the phone. They just finished talking to uh, President Talon of Benin Republic. Oh, they just finished speaking to this and that. Oh, they have this uh, this and that. They were uh, you know he said, my don't listen to them. Don't listen to them. I trust you. I trust you. Nobody is talking to any talon. Nobody. You know what I'm talking about. But again, that's, that put me in that state. The state whereby, listen to me. Oh. I know they do, I know they do two some. I know they do three some. I know they do group. I am somebody that is always like when I want to get myself in, get myself in, involved in anything, right? I I do the pros, I check the pros, I check the cons, I weigh every option, then I set my plan. When I set my plan, I always know how it's going to start. I know how it's going to end, and when I'm done, you will always know that it's done. It's not part of that anymore. That's done. It's closed. I know they do two some. I know they do three some. So don't feel offended. If I need your help, I'll reach out to you. That is the. That's what I have now. And we'll begin to see that. And uh, when I come back with how this is going to go, uh, the platform here and there, yeah, I should be bringing uh, Bashegu here. Because on this platform, this is where I'm going to possibly understand if Bashegu indeed understands what we want to do. So if uh, Ilano UK are ready to accept that role, and they understand what we want to do, it will be done on this program. I know they do private talk only. Because you see, I spoke with uh, Baha Shegun, and he was so much interested. And they also felt so kind of uh, honored. All right? But we are going to find out on Mayegun's diary political when we bring him here. Okay? We are also going to bring other people too, which is just me trying to understand if these people who claim to love Sunday Igbo, if they indeed understand what it means for Sunday Igbo to keep spending every night in that illegal detention. So if they know it and they are ready to follow, to, to, to do this with us, eh? Aha, uh -huh. all of us go know. Uh, trust my friends, they will be like, Mayegu, See, Mayegun, bring that, bring that woman back again. Uh -huh. Yeah, he knows what he's talking about. He know, she knows what she's talking about. Mayegun, bring that man back again. I like that man. That's my friends. This is the parliament. This is the temple of truth. I know they do back-end meeting. Again, you see, I'm repeating it. I'm repeating it. 
I don't do backend meet. I don't do behind the scene meet. I don't take phone calls. I don't do chat, except if I want to talk to you. So don't be offended, yeah. And don't think this my ego. This my ego proud, sha. Ah, oh yeah, yeah, money. This is my ego proud. I've been hearing that a lot. The point is that uh, I know how to get what I want, especially when I know what I want. And get, do you want me to shock you? Eh? Majority of my friends, eh? They have been accustomed to that. If my ego wants that, he knows how to get what he wants. And we trust him that he always, always, always gets what he wants. And we will venture. If he was interested in this, this is a big thing. We will do it with you. Check, read the comment. If you are surprised, read the comment. Are you not reading the comment? Those are my friends. They are ready. It's like a dog whistle. Once I bring my whistle and I say, hey, yo, Mary, whoa. Eh, from the temple of truth, people will respond because and that is why I'm called my ego. And that's why I'm still my ego. So if you feel, if you think that is a sign of pride, ah, ha, ha. you haven't met my friends. And I want you to meet my friends. See them. Meet my friends. Anyway, I have delivered that. I decided I'm going to do this session for Loye Sunday as an update. And I'm not going to add anything extra. I would it normally I've got some loaded stuff uh, behind this uh, political stuff I would love to discuss with you, right? But I'm gonna keep that for the next time. They don't go away, do they? They just pile up and we have a lot of stuff to talk about the next time, yeah. But I'm gonna open the line. For the sake of uh, those who probably want to respond to my updates, because last night we said, okay, go, go, Mayogun, do it. Some were even telling me, Mayogun, see, we don't want Igbo to even give approval. You don't need Igbo's approval. Just let's do it. We are tired. We want something done. Now I've come back to tell you that uh, is there a jam back on? Eh? I don't come back now. Good or bad, I don't give you the news. So, so what I'm going to do now is that I'm going to go do a refill. You know what I'm talking about? The refill of my of my teacup. So when I get back, I will start taking uh, taking calls, and I want to hear your own uh, response to all of this. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, suwe, 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 suwe. Anyway, my line is opened. So if you want to call in and make a contribution, right, you have to call the WhatsApp. It's on your screen. You will see there, plus 4460 I think. So you see that there. And uh, no, sorry. My bad. Plus 44 uh, 7963601010. So that's a WhatsApp uh, uh, link to my studio. So hang on. Of course, this as well. Person where they do evil, no one may person talk. Them say that my yegun, that man do they talk? He do they talk? Say my yegun diary, he they hot like baby. Thank you. So I can take the calls now, yeah. Hello there, my yegun Baba. Sir, good evening, Baba. Wale, Wale from Wales. Wale from Wales is uh that's thank that's, you that's, for you're my first caller by the way so now he did thank right you right. for the i called yesterday and Indeed. thanks for the um for the speedy um um response you 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 did on this uh on this job um um are we can you please send us the account to start making this payment yeah. and um can i just uh plead to everybody yeah. that Let's all uh, please contribute towards this. Yes, it is our fight, it is our life, it is our struggle. That's right. And That's if, right. The, if we can't make it in two weeks, we will put more to it. Sure. Just as um, sure. you said, Chief um, Tunumbu um, slogan is, "Anything money can do, more money will do." We <laughs> is not more money, hmm. more sense, and um, with the strength of God, we would we would do it. I believe. Yeah. Thank you. Please so much. send us the link. I don't want to waste your time. God Thank you very you. much. That means a uh, positive start. That's a positive start. I have the first person that feels like uh, they can't wait. Now let's hear from another caller. Hello. Hello. Hello, sir. Uh, hello, my good. My sir. Good evening, my good. This is Adeliki from France. You say Adeliki from France. Yes, my ego. Amazing, sir. So you're live. Everybody can hear you. My ego, you are doing a fantastic job. Thank you. God will bless you and reward you and your family. Amen. Thank you. And I, have, I don't have a lot to say, but, mm. but uh, every time we are just discussing, what of if there is a coup d'etat? Hmm. No, if because that's what Fulani believe in. If there is a coup d'etat, what is our next option? Yoruba will say no or not. Hmm. Yes. We have to plan ahead because Fulani, they don't believe in... I must tell you the truth, Fulani and British government, they don't know nothing more than coup d'etat. When something is like this, when something is like this, Mm. Mm. Niger British ambassador to Nigeria, please. My go Google her name. I know, I know her history. Mm. Google where she works. I know what she has done there. Try it. Mm. She's in Nigeria for a mission. If there is good data, anytime, what can we do? What can the Yoruba do? Hmm. Yes. Can we say no to Fulani or we just accept it? No, we have to plan. God bless you. Because you so because because uh, Professor Professor what's the, the man I forgot his name. Which Professor Akito said mm -hmm. if 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 Fulani said fellow Nigerians, we should tell them we are not we are not your fellow Nigerian. Mm. We should reject it. Because Fulani, that's their plan. Mm. 
Now they know that everything is going down, down, down. They know that's the next plan. Hmm. Don't, don't just brush it aside. I Think brush about it. it. Brush aside, DK. Everybody is listening to you attentively. You ask a very, you know, you we ask a, to... a very, a very, very good question. If that happens, what are we going to do? Because can tomorrow, we say no? they, all, they, they know what they say. Uh, tomorrow they can just tell us, mm -hmm. um, um, fellow Nigeria, I regret you, I have Diko on behalf of my colleagues. What can we do? Hmm. We have to receive them. Thank you, sir. Let Since 1960, they have been playing us like ball, like ball, football, football. We, enough is enough. Hmm. My you, sir. continue with your good job. Thank you. And you too, bye sir. Bye. Thank you so much. You have a good one, sir. That's a very powerful one, though. You know, that's one thing about uh, this platform. You can always think outside the box, and it's so important. Yeah? Hello. Hello, my Hello, ma. Good How are you? Know. Good evening. Yeah, this is the... Uh, Shola Davis from London. Oh, uh, Lady Shola Davis from London. Things. Yes, ma. Hey, go on, yeah. ma. Okay, go ahead. Okay, thank you for bringing this idea up. I've been saying it before anyway. Mm -hmm. But thank you for making it to happen. But I call you because of the man that is asking now, mm -hmm. if there is school, what do we do? Mm -hmm. Of course, we are not part of Nigeria. Even if there is school, it will make it faster for the school I need to be, to be grounded mm -hmm. for life. Because mm -hmm. if you look at the trend in the West Africa now, mm -hmm. the people of Mali, the people of Burkina Faso, and all of them are getting rid of the fuller in their government. So mm -hmm. even if, if we are we to be in government now, they are ready to liaise with us to even get rid of them and all these foreign powers. Mm -hmm. So let them come with that. Mm -hmm. The thing that will kill is already is already there, but we Mm. If they come with their food, we're not part of them. I don't want to divert what we're doing today to mm. all those things. Mm. We are trying to set up something for Igbo, and that's what we're going to... But we're going to, you know, we are ready for them. I just want that man to know. I love that. So, I love that, man. So we're waiting for the... We're waiting for the... Yeah, maybe the paper, but be, I want you to be careful with the this thing. Uh, um, the one you said we should, we are going to use mm. the medium. You mm. said we are going to use the mm. common one. I mm. forgot it. It just went off my head now because uh, you know sometimes. Go they, <laughs> Do you, you mean know, that or Bitcoin the, or which the, one? Go on. There was a popular one. The go fund me. Go fund me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we need to, to 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 be ahead of these people. If they know we are raising money or this, too, they could you know you know all the, you know the, down, you, you remember. Right. The GoFundMe, we did the first time, hmm. and they just turn everything down. So we have to be smart this I mean, time around. I mean, you know, you, right. you you are so right. People have to, we need to be careful. That's why I said I'm going to take my time, Ma, yeah? Because you are so right, yeah? yeah? The truckers who are currently uh, currently protesting in Canada, yeah? People set up uh, yeah. GoFundMe for them, right? And because the <laughs> government of Canada is really, really not having that, yeah? They've shut down uh -huh. that GoFundMe. This one is just yesterday. So so we need to be careful we about that. Be. And mm -hmm. the other thing I want to say is that yeah. some people back home, they called, we I had a meeting with a number of them, they were agreed that they were prepared to go to Kutonu, mm. to go and sit there. Mm. But they, they, they were, the people were telling them, to t you said the people were telling them to take it easy when they are working on it, there's diplomatic things going on, they don't want to be disrupted. I think as we are planning, it is, if people are ready to go and they do a sit down solidarity rally, mm -hmm. we should incorporate it with, with what we're doing now. Mm -hmm. Thank you. God so bless you, man. <laughs> Thank so, you so much. Yeah. You have a good one. That's a brilliant one from uh, our lady there, Shola Davis from London. I mean, it's brilliant. I have another caller on the line. Hello. Hello. Hello, my good evening. Hello, Baba. How are you? I'm okay. I mean, I'm very, very fine. Hundred percent with this news. <laughs> Hundred. Class. So tell 100. me about it. Hundred. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, um, with everything you said, you've been um, on point. And I uh, actually, what I like about your message this evening is about your professionalism. This is all what we need. Mm -hmm. See, being professional about whatever you do goes a long way. That's right. And I like how you've been blunt about it. Mm -hmm. I mean, thank you. That is what we need. And um, oh, people now, you know, people they, they, they have yeah. done a lot that I don't really want to go into. And if you want yeah. to be different, I, yeah, you should, I, you should, you should make yourself very clear from the I beginning. 
I know they do emotional yeah, I attaching. I, I know they do any behind the scenes conversation. I know they do meeting. Baba, like you said, I'm bringing in the Ilano Motua UK. I mean, trying um, the Yoruba lawyer plan mm -hmm. is one of the reasons why we need to test ourselves yeah. towards the upcoming part we're going to have. At, at least we want to have the urbanization. Yes, we want sir. to have our country. So mm -hmm. we should be able 